I had to finish my degree during COVID, but I didn't mind because, like I said, I liked the remote thing. I actually really liked remote classes. It was a lot easier for me, especially work-life balance. But I know that's not a lot of people's, not a lot of people's feelings on it either. Or experiences. Plus, not ever, not a lot of places, uh, freaking offered, you know, the help to do that. You know, actually offered online classes for enough shit. The chain falls away, and you push the gate. Open the gate to the church far beyond. Okay, find the rat's nest in the graveyard's church. Okay, well, let me look around first. Anything? Those stained glass windows look cool. I like how they did that. Do you remember when you were a kid, you, uh, could, in, like, a lot of art classes, you would make art with, like, tissue paper and glue that you would, like, paint onto the tissue paper, and it would come out looking like that? Like these windows? Or is it just me? <laughs> She did it online for two weeks and hated it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, exactly. It's not everybody's uh, it's not everybody's bag, baby. I get it. I know a lot of people who hated it. It's just too detaching, uh, too detached, and and no help. I feel like if my, if depending on what my degree was, you know, would make a big difference. If I if I had something that was like a lot more, if I had classes left that were a lot more involved in in ways that I. If I had like a lot of math classes or shit like that, that, that could have been really rough. Or science or labs or anything like that. But thankfully where I was at, I was just in like senior project classes and shit. So it was a lot easier to just deal with a lecture, you know. Attempt to pick up the candlestick and find attachments and mechanism inside the altar. A latch flips and you watch a stack of boxes slide aside. Hey, check it out. Wait, was there something else down here? Okay, okay. I'll scavenge. I'll do a little scavenging. Look at these little rats. They're all so cute. Okay. Are these little beds? That's unnerving. There's only two of them, also. They're just straight up two people living here. It, if there were more, it would be like a little less unnerving because it'd be like, oh, is it like a sanctuary type of... Maybe I had to have the word sanctuary on my mind. So we're talking about animal sanctuary. Maybe, but, you know, is it like a place where, you know, people can just... Maybe all the church people live here or like they help people who don't, you know, who don't have a, a home. Ew, I told you he was going to be nasty. Look at this little creature. Oh, wait, he's kind of cute in the picture though. Who in blazes are you? Who let you in? She feels kind of dumb being almost 30 and not having finished school yet. Dude, I, f I, I, I understand why, but, like, she's got nothing to worry about. I didn't finish my degree until I was, like, 26, about to be 27. I was, like, it was, like, a month before I turned 27. So, like, she's not alone. It's very normal, especially, like, now where it's a lot harder to afford school and to, like, do shit like that and to work and do it at the same time and it's really intense. And also, who cares? You know, just do what makes you feel good, you know? What, what works for you? I would, I would, I wouldn't change a thing. I'm very, I left school and came back like multiple times and I'm very glad I did. Because of all these different experiences I ended up getting in my life. And that's also how I met Steven. So totally worth it. I let myself in. You should really hide your secret lair a bit better though. I must admit this is quite the collection you've acquired. You looking to make a trade? We got whatever you need, sister. If you can pay the price. We've got plenty of brooches. Any of these beauties catch your eye? Well, we don't know what it looks like. They all look like precious family heirlooms, but you can't pick out the one belonging to the Banshee. Are you seriously going to make me go back and just talk to her? There's so much back and forth. Come on. She said it feels weird being the oldest one in her classes, too. Yeah, yeah. No, I get that. Especially depending on where you go, too. Like, some places there might be, like, a more older... A more... An older demographic in the... In, the, uh, in your classes, but in a lot of other places, it's like, oh my god, I'm, like... 30 and there's literal children here like there's literally 18 year olds here this is crazy <laughs> but like again you know it's all about your education man you know and like you're never too old to get to, to learn stuff either like i like i don't know maybe one day i'll go back for a different bachelor's you know or i don't know maybe i got my master's or some shit why she's the original owner of course you'd very much like her property return to her we don't make trades with the dead well you're just a right bastard aren't you this place is sacred ground. No bad spirits can enter here. Now get out before we pick you clean. Okay. Back to the church altar. What are we going to do there? Now 
No spirits may cross the threshold, eh? Well, then I'll just have to invite one in myself. Spirit board! Okay, let's get down on some Ouija board shit, I guess. Sure, that's fine. Oh, man. Do I have enough to make another one of these? Fuck! Uh, of course not. Pain in my butt. And dog hair. And in order to get dog hair, I gotta do this business. And in order to do that, I gotta do this. Here, we got one of those. So now we got one of these. So now we can go get some dog hair so we can make this. Alright. God damn it. How do I even get out of here? Oh, okay. There you go. So we'll go to the... Uh Can I get it from this dog that's right here? I don't want to hurt him. I mean, we don't we don't kill the dogs. They draw the line at the dogs for sure. He just goes sees. We didn't have to put him to sleep though. I should have just been able to. He wasn't okay. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Um. All right, so we got this. What is this? This looks pretty. Moonlight globe. Nice. Gotta go get one of those bad boys. And in order to do that, we gotta have one of these. And in order to do that, we gotta have one of these. Alright. Maybe I should walk back over there so I can collect a few things. I'm gonna take the long way pick up some ingredients along the way. Alright, bud. His little legs feel feel tight. <laughs> Sometimes I gotta give his little chicken wings a little muscle massage after we do a long walk. I learned that from his vet because he actually had to get knee surgery last year. And uh, one of the reasons that he was, like, while he was healing, they were like, like, feel his leg right here, and it was like hard as a rock. And they were like, it's it's a muscle thing. You gotta help loosen his little baby muscles up. So you gotta like rub his little leg. It's like, oh, okay, sure, no problem, bud. You're a dick. Cobblestone nail. Fields. That's where we're trying to go anyway. Ah! Back. My bones. Maybe we'll get some of those herbs along the way. That would be nice. Do y'all say herbs or herbs? I don't know anybody who says herbs. Unless you're saying like someone's name, like Herbert, you know? Herb. Can I get any of those here? I don't even know if that's an option. Oh, it's this guy. I love this guy. This weird little cabbage friend. Cabbage child, even. And then the pumpkin feels up here, right? Pumpkin Jack? Gotcha. Gotcha. Alright. Grab that piece of wood there. Alright. Where's that? Is that other entrance up here? <sighs> Truly cannot even remember. No, but that's okay. Just two music classes I'd be glad to help her out with if she needed. Oh yeah, Yodel King. Music. It makes sense. It all adds up. <laughs> Are you big into music theory? Does music theory make sense to you? Music theory makes me want to rip my hair out. And I had to take a bunch of classes on it in college. 
and uh, I ended up doing great in them, but I did not retain very much of it. Steven's the music theory guy, for sure. He's, like, very knowledgeable on that kind of stuff, and he worked very hard to, as far as I'm concerned, like, master it. <laughs> like, he's incredible. Um, oops, oh, that's, that's why I was moving. Took it in college and had to teach a class. That's crazy. You've taught classes before? Good for you. Wait, wait, wait. I shouldn't have come all the way back here. I should have made sure I could make the board, didn't I? Was there something else I needed? Hold on. Hold on. Let me see. Oh, no. I think we're okay. I think I just needed to make this, this thing. Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, down here. We're in the church now. Hi, Schwankman! Why did I have music theory classes? Me or Brad? <laughs> uh, I had music theory classes because my degree is in music business. Uh, and so part of that involved learning a little bit about theory and performance so that I could be a well-rounded music major. Took guitar and piano too, but not really enough to amount to anything. Yeah, I'm with you on that. I think a lot of uh, instrumental classes in college end up like that, where it's like, well, you know, I get it. You know, I, I have enough to like understand what's going on, but I'm not gonna run with it, you know? I would like to play it a little bit more, you know? I, I, liked, I, I haven't played guitar in a really long time, but I kind of got into piano for a minute there. Once I had the right instructor, I actually got really into piano. Close your eyes and place your hands on the planchette of the spirit board. Concentrating hard, you try to focus on all sorts of haunted mansion. The planchette begins to twitch and move, slowly tracing out letters on the board. Who is this? Oh, come on now. Who else would it be? I'm calling to let you know I found where the rat is. You might want to come down here and speak to him. How did we get, how did we get her? Out of all the spirits we could get, we got, we got the banshee? wind rushes through the church and you can hear the squealing of rats as they dive for cover. On the gale comes the screams of the dead reverberating through the halls. The spirit board shudders and splits with the noise and the skeletal hand claws its way out from the people of the crack point shed. Got to perform with the college choir in New York City too. That's amazing! Something you should be very proud of, man. The vengeful spirit howls and flies straight through your body as she sweeps down into the rat's hideout. Okay, let's go check it out. Part of a college choir festival. Yeah, how exciting. College choir must be so fun because you're with people who, well, I guess, presumably, take it, like, very seriously and, like, are there for a reason. I was in choir from, like, first grade to senior year of high school. And, you know, there's not always a lot of people who take it very seriously and also, like, even teachers who just don't give a shit. And so it's, like, it, it's nice to nice thought to have people who really are working hard on their craft. So I hope that's what your experience was. It was a simple misunderstanding. Sure, that's what they all say. The rat's bulging eyes look onto you, lock onto you in desperation. This is your doing, isn't it? Yeah, well, I'm merely helping to settle a dispute. You thought all your grave thought robbing wouldn't come with consequences? Face justice for your crimes, thief. The dead have come for you. The banshee whirls around like a hurricane, drawing with her an innumerable host of ghosts and spirits. No, get off us, you wretches. You were dead, finders, keepers. Spectral claws grab onto the rat and his vem- I did it again. Veminous? Why would I- why would that be what that word is? Verminous minions and drag them squealing into the other world. Hey, good for her. Powerful as hell. With the crack of thunder, the howling wind evaporates, not a single rat remains. A calm falls over the banshee as she reaches down and picks up one of the scattered brooches left on the floor. My brooch, it's back, it's safe, I can finally sleep. Music education and vocal performance was my major. That's great! Very fitting for Yodel King. <laughs> did you ever end up teaching in general? What did you want to do with your degree? She clutches her treasure to her breast and looks at you with a final crooked smile before fading away in a glimmer of ghostly smoke. All good. In the eerie silence of the cave, you see something squirming in the debris. Ooh. Is it 
Is it the t the tails all tangled together? Yeah, the soul of the rat. That's what the remember last time we were talking about the king rat, and it's a bunch of rats that get tangled together by their tails in the subway of, of like New York City, and they have to run around and move like a single unit. I hate that. The goat will be wanting to take custody of these four. Best not to keep them waiting. All right, fuck it. Let's just go. Recorded in Nashville, but unfortunately it didn't work out. Oh man. Bummer it didn't work out, but recording in Nashville sounds like a really cool experience. Please leave me alone. Alright, let's go see what the goat has to say. I wonder if, like, this is it, or if we have a whole other... No, I bet there's more, because there's that whole other area we haven't unlocked yet. Let's talk to the goat. This lantern is extremely helpful. Hi, little doggy. Sorry I put you to sleep before. I guess we could have just gone to the thing. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know what I'm doing. We gotta get back to uh, that main teleporty area. Do we need water right now? How much water do I have? Oh, I have three. Nah, I'm good. Producer lost a battle with throat cancer before the CD was released. He was going to pass around all the major record labels. Oh man, that's heartbreaking. Jeez. Cancer's no fucking joke, man. Huh? Well, I'm sorry to hear that, but... You can, you know, you can still do some good stuff with your music if you want to. At least have some fun with it. Maybe... Where's, like, the main... I don't know where the... The main travel area is in here. I guess I can just look at the map. I guess. <laughs> Always complaining about there not being a map and then never uses it. There it is. Is that up here? Yeah, there we go. He heard it through and said, Mine was his favorite he ever did. Wow! Oh man! Well, that's an honor. Jeez. Something to be proud of yet again. I had to drink some more water. Okay. All right, Black Philip, what saith ye? I don't know if this is the main theme, but this is my favorite song, I think, on the on the soundtrack. Oh, it's gone. Hello. The goat snorts with delight at your approach. Wonderful, you've returned to more souls. These were even more troublesome than the last. I'll be glad to be rid of them. Clanging of the ram's bronze bell rings out in your ears. Many voices chanting in unison, grabbing hands, trampling feet. The, ma the machinations of the cat unfold before you as her boots burn away before the shrine. Pieces moving on a game board. Cheats, laughter, lies. Sensations of the rat fill your mind. Tiny feet scratching at crumbling walls, digging cold earth, snapping brittle bones, taking, stealing, hiding. Cat was cat. You hold your breath as the salty feeling of the fish washes over you. The sound of the creaking wood. Jagged barnacles, crashing waves, fading light, betrayal. Man, Brad, that's really cool. You must be really good at what you do. That's that's really exciting. Good memories to hold on to. Hi, Humble! Making some chicken soup? My Karen of a neighbor is finally selling her house? Dude, sounds like a fucking banger of a Wednesday night. I am very happy for you. <laughs> chicken soup and the neighbor you hate is leaving? I mean, what else? 
what else could a, what else could a person want? Four more souls, but I expect it's been a tiring day. Come, you should get some sleep. Okay, so we need four more. Okay. So what are we looking at? How many how many are we looking at here? This is the last four that we'll need, I'm guessing, according to what he just said. But who are they? What do we need? Should we go talk to him again, I guess? See if maybe... Maybe he can shed some light on it. Poor maiden. I know! She got her face all done up as well. Face beat! Just to sleep. Can't even have fun with her makeup. You step out into the morning mist and find the goat with a mouthful of grass. Terrible tasting stuff. I don't understand this creature's appetite. With luck, you won't have to suffer the mortal whims of a farm animal much longer. After I collect the last souls, you can go back to the void from which you came. You are correct. There is only one leg left to our journey, but the final four souls have revealed themselves to me. At least he uh, considers us good company. Three linger in the spaces you've already tread. The village, the market, and the fields. And the fourth resides far to the north in the cold slopes of the mountain. Yep, that's the area we haven't unlocked yet. I'll track them down no matter where they try to hide. Okay. Hogs in the market, stag on the mountain, hawk in the fields, and wolf in the village. Where should we go first? Market, mountain, fields, village. Market, mountain, fields, village. Maybe... Well, let's see if we... Can we just go into the new place? Yeah, fuck it. Let's just go to the new one. Oh, no, we can't go there yet. Okay. Uh, is this the market? Let's go to the market. Let's check out the piggies. Rocky is sound asleep next to me. I'm very happy for him because a lot of the time he starts to get fidgety after a couple hours now because he has to go to the bathroom more often. But I think as we've been doing a more, more often we're doing longer walks uh, and I think that that's helping him uh, not only empty his sweet little bladder out but <laughs> also uh, I guess I just have to find him. Um, but also it tuckers him out, so I think he's like not as nervous and he's just like a little more, you know, likely to just sleep and not feel like he's got to be doing something. Maybe I'm projecting. Clinging to a raggedy shawl, the old panhandler holds a tin cup with trembling hands. Alms for the poor. Did you say you do artist management for musicians? Is there a way I could send you some of my stuff? Yeah, sure. Uh, you got a Twitter? <laughs> or an Instagram? You bow your head respectfully to the aged fellow, dropping in a coin into his cup. From under his ratty hood, the man gleams a silver tooth grin at you. Thank you, kind miss. Penny for your thoughts, old timer? Afraid my thoughts are a little muddy as of late. Can't seem to recall what day it is or when the last time I ate was. Last I remember, I was working at the old hog farm with the other unfortunates. Not quite sure how I ended up back here on the streets? Question mark? Had more than a few memories abandoned me as well. Say, I must have left a few of my things behind at the farm, misplaced my boot, and well, I can't remember what else. I don't suppose you do me the kindness of taking a look around the place for me. I'm not as spry as I used to be. At the hog farm, you say? I guess it wouldn't hurt to take a peek. Maybe they haven't lost and found. Bless your heart, I do remember that you'll need permission to do to go to get... I do remember that you'll need permission to get through the gates. Those hog sisters run a tight ship. You'll have to talk to the big hog who runs the butcher shop here in the market. She'll set you up with a work slip. Oh, okay. Oh, you're old school. You want email? Well, you can do the 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 business email I use for uh for Neon Peach Gaming. That's fine. Um, I think it's just Neon Peach Biz B I Z at uh Gmail. Um, and that way, at the very least, then I can listen to some of your stuff. That's fun. If anything, we'll be able to add you to a roster of people that we might, you know, look at to help out and to work with and stuff like that. Pretty jam-packed right now, but who knows what the future holds. Where's the... Is, did he say the butcher? Where the hell was the butcher? We went there, didn't we? This is the candle guy.
Um, where? There is a tiny little black speck on my screen and it's driving me nuts, but it's too far away for me to reach. Okay, Baker. Oh my god, somebody is barreling down the stairs outside. Jesus. She's literally shaking the walls of my apartment. Where, um... Hello? Oh, there it is. The chopping block. Love that. Great name. Oh, isn't this lovely? Okay, hate it here. Big pig chopping through a hock of meat with a Well, I don't like this either. You shouldn't be a pig chopping up other pigs. That feels wrong. Chopping through a hock of meat with a gigantic cleaver, the surly looking swine merely grunts at you when you approach. Heard that you were one to talk about getting a work slip? That's what you heard? Well, you heard wrong. We got enough good for nothing workers. Now buzz off. Okay. Listen, there must be some way to get a slip. Running low on ingredients to make the summer sausage and none of these nincompoops can hold two thoughts in their heads. Oh, here, I'll put it in chat. Tell you what, get me, you get me the things I need and I'll give you your precious work slip. Okay. Hold on, I'm typing. I think this is it. Oops. Dot. I think that's it. Okay. So, we've, oh, we've, luckily we've got eggs. Beautiful. How do I get rid of the... Oops. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I accidentally got rid of my whole stream thing. Okay, we got the eggs. Uh, we need roast beast and skipper scale. Roast beast? Isn't that from the Grinch? Uh, we need the, the, the forest herb. Okay, well, I think that's a good place to stop for today. We went a little bit longer than usual anyway, which was nice. Um, I'm sweepy. I'm gonna, like, go maybe take a bath and then make dinner. Or maybe I should make dinner first, because then I'll get too tired after a bath. I don't know, we'll see. Oh! But I'm gonna do something to chill out. I'm gonna have a nice relaxing night, and I hope you all do too. Um, thank you for hanging out. Uh, thank you for sharing your passions with me, i.e. music and life and uh, any general life happiness that's been happening. I love hearing that from you guys. Um, this has been great. Uh, I feel like we, we made, every time we've been going further and further in this game, we're making good progress. I feel like I have a good grasp on how it works now, so I'm enjoying it greatly. Uh, and I hope you guys are too. So, uh, just a reminder, we're not streaming tomorrow. I'm going to take a week off because i got to catch up on all my YouTube stuff and work has just been crazy. So, I'm just going to take a week off. So, we'll be back not this coming Monday, but the Monday after that. I love you and have a good night.